everybody, it's Amy from Amy's Resin Corner. Okay, I want to show you a few things before I do this again. I bought some flower drying silica gel crystal. I got this off Amazon. Okay, and I put me some flowers in it. And they have dried very nicely. The gel, it is, it'll be like a yellow specks all in it. And then when you need to change it, it'll turn green. And I'm very much liking this. Um, oh, I can't remember the name of these flowers. I knew I'd do it. I forget. Y'all know my mind. And my daughter got me these. Threshold Base Filler. She got them somewhere. Got them for $2. So I can't wait to use them. Not going to use them in this, but I am going to use them. Okay, now, let me do my shout outs before I do all this. Okay, I do want to say, um, oh, what's her name? Well, pouring your heart out, Miss Julie, Wanda's Blessed Creations, Miss Wanda Faye, Epoxy Me That, Bex Craft Designs, Coral Marines Resin Art, Miss Coral, Resin Nut, Sherry Moulton, and The Resin Rainbow. And I am totally forgetting somebody. I'll just say thank you to Miss C. Because she watches me all the time. And I don't know why my mind went so blank. Um, and I do want to say thank you to all my subscribers. Because we have now hit over a thousand on the last video. And now it's, I think, over a thousand twenty. So, yay! Thank all of you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, if you find yourself coming back, please subscribe, and thank you to all my OG, my old people that watch me all the time, my old subscribers, and thank you to my new subscribers. Okay, I'm going to do my little thing here, my card. Mental health matters, and it most certainly does. I do have problems with that sometimes. So, I really, really like this one. Now, my mom, I talked about her in the last one. She really wanted um, red, something red. Okay, what my final product was not like a red and white or something, so I'm going to make a red and white one. Now, I am going to see if I can dust just a little bit of this on, because I've already got my resin uh, mixed, 11 ounces. Lowered. I just want a light dusting. Okay. 
just something to make some of the bees stand out. I did get these off Amazon. Not really worried about the black and different colors. I just kind of wanted to just get a vague um, thing of the bee on here. It does not have to be perfect on this one. I mean, I do want it to look really nice for my mom. But, at the same time, it's going to be red and white. this off around him here if I can if I can't that's fine because just a little bit of gold out there actually would be kind of nice now that I'm thinking about it let me see if I can just put a few marks It's like here, there. Okay. Now on this one, I'm just going to brush the B. in the honeycomb. <sighs> That's all the colors that I'm really wanting to Because I just mainly want this thing to, you know, to do the red and white. But I do want, like, a few marks to tie it in with the gold. Get it in there. See, that's all that I wanted in there besides my red and white. You blow these off. I'm gonna keep these kind of close so I can get them. Okay. 
Now, let me mix this back up. Now, I'm going to put that one in there. I did get a little bit of uh, red glitter. I'm just going to put a little bit of that in there. And I've also, which this stuff gets all over my hands. I don't know what it is about this paste. It's eye candy, which they're, they're very, 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 very good. In my opinion but it will dye your hands I'm telling you this red is potent so is the black I've had this for a long time it has not dried up on me it's not gotten hard I haven't had to put it in a uh, hot water bath or anything See, it's, it's dripping. Now, I'm going to see if that's enough. Hopefully, it will be. I'm have to get out more napkins. Good Lord. I have to rewash the outside of this. I don't know how it keeps getting red on it. Cause I'm very careful when I open it. So I don't I don't know. Okay, let me see. I may have to put more red. I don't know. I don't think so. No, that's plenty red. Now, I'm going to take this. I don't want much in there. So, I'll just put just a little bit. Because I want it to see. Hopefully, I didn't put too much. I want to see it here or there. The little flakes. Yeah. I just don't want it. I don't want too much in it. Okay, there's my red. Now, over here, I am going to put my casting craft. I'm going to use it because I don't want to use mica powder on these. I just don't. four in it. Now let's see how well that does. And I did mix these up in cups I've already used because I want to at least get two out of it if I can. So I mix both I mix some up in both of them and then now I'm putting the color in. I'm gonna see how that works. Just not have enough white. But I don't want to put too much white because I want it to dry. Now I'll put four more drops in it.
Oh, stink bug got in my building. No. It's kind of hard for you to see. Maybe. But it is. It's white, but it, I don't know. It's even if you put it on the side of it, it's still um. You still see uh, transparent. Do it like this and let it drop off. It's transparent. I'm really surprised at that with it being the casting craft. Okay, yeah, I don't know how many that was. I squeezed it a little too hard. Yeah, I'm not putting any more of that in. That should be good. I am going to put some real fine gl white glitter that's uh, holographic. But I'm not putting much of it either. I may have put just a little bit too much of that. I'm hoping not. Because I don't want this all about glitter. I want this more about color. Okay, that's not bad. Okay. I'm going to wipe this off. This stick I'd already used in red, so it's going to have red on it already, but it will dye your stuff very quickly. <laughs> Get some of this off me. Okay, I am actually going to pour some of the white. around there and on the top here I'm just gonna start a little bit on each side then I'm gonna let it try to level out Now I'm just going to start this in the middle. Whew. 
Woo. Dropped a few drops. Now this was 11 ounces. I could probably still put some in there. But you make it go 10 ounces with this. I'm going to spray it with 99% isopropyl alcohol and see if it'll bring up some of the um, bubbles and then I can spray it again. We'll see if we use this all. I really want some white in this. Because this has more red than white. I might have to put just the rest of the white in this. There's not much. It may be the right amount. 11 ounces. Okay, so that's all my white. Honestly, it's looking really nice. Do not like how I put too much. I put too much red on this one over here. I, I for me, but for my mom, she may absolutely adore it. Cause that's just her favorite color it has been my whole life. It looks like some yellow dots. Oh, it's the, um, oh lord, mica powder, the gold mica powder. There was a flake in it. There's some on this, too. But that's all right. Just make a little hard in it. Don't think she'll too much care. <laughs> that one's under that one up there. This one still needs a little more. Little tiny bit here.
we'll just see what that turns into. Okay, well, that's it. There's not much left at all in here. So, I made up 11. There might be a half an ounce in there, so it may be 10 and a half. Because my table is pretty much level now. Alright, well, that's what we have for you today. I'll get cleaned up in just a minute. But, thank you for watching, and we'll be back for demolding day. Remember, just because you don't like it does not mean someone else won't. Remember, remember, and please like, share, subscribe, hit that bell. I really appreciate what everybody has been doing for me. God bless you all. Thank you. Y'all have a great day. Bye for now. Hi, it's the morning day. I'm Amy from Amy's Resin Corner. I do want to show y'all this in case you can see it. It looks like a volcano that has erupted. It's very cool. I love that. This isn't quite dry. You can still see your fingernail in it. And the coasters are still bendy. And I do have my sister and them are working on uh, actually uh, painting my some more stuff outside. So you can see it'll pop off the sides, but it is still bendy. I'm hoping I can. So there's that. Oh, let me show you this one. So, I did put some glitter in here. I did put too much. I was scared I was going to do that. But I do like that. I think it's pretty. It's just got too much glitter for me. I, did, I just wanted it sparingly. I figure, it may, I'm hoping maybe if I pull this out, that it might go on and dry a little faster. See, it does bend. You can definitely see the bend. Oh, that one's very pretty, I think. That's the way them two went. Oh, here's the other one. This one I kind of put a little bit too much. It's got a little bit of overflow going around just this one side. So I will see what I can do about that and get that off. Let me know if you like this and down in the comments and if I do another one what color you think would look good. So there they are. I'm not going to demold my owl because there's not enough in it but I'll probably demold that on the next video. So, here they are. And I'm going to actually flip it so this can continue to dry. 
I'm going to flip it, leave this, because this was the top, and I want it to dry. This one I've got to work on, but I think they all turned out very nice. I really like them. Um, I'm going to see if this will work on it, but I don't know if it will, because it's, it's so bendy. So, that is not going to work. I might have to get my little scissors out. Well, when it's this bendy, you can actually get it with scissors. And then you can uh, come back and sand it a little. That looks so much better just from doing that. This one isn't quite where I want it. There's just a little tiny bit. Angle it a little bit. But this looks, this is how they look. So I appreciate you watching. Uh, please continue um, to like and share and comment. And if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. I really appreciate every single one of you. This was mine from the last one. So I didn't have enough red for my mom. She wanted red and white. So she's got red and white now. So as soon as it's done drying, I will walk it up to her house and give it to her. But just remember, just because you do, you do not like it does not mean someone else won't. And thank you. I hope y'all have a blessed day. And I will see you again on the next one. I love you all. Mwah.